is attempting to break the record going round Wales. Oh, my hair. I was just doing, um... Quack, quack, quack. <laughs> just came out. Well done, bullet. Uh... Right, you can see Phil's thumbnail is uh, is done. Um, here's, here's the final product. Here's the thinking behind it. So Phil wanted... Let me get his email up. So Phil uh, said he's looking to launch vid, focus very much on head training session. The first thing to do is cut Phil out. I do a rough cut uh, in case um, I, you know, we don't use like this. Um, Phil also sent me these as background. So but as you can see, uh, probably not that you can't see actually, a bit blurry. because obviously they're just screenshot from Zwift. So then I uh, create these in a vector. Be zoomed in as large as you want and they'll still be nice and crisp and stuff. So uh, we've got Phil behind, so I faded in the, the intervals and had a lot of play with some stuff, put Phil in the background so you can see Phil's pain face um, and then got it over onto the Mac, onto Luminar.ai and just uh, improved it, made it pop a bit, added a little bit of a vid vignette uh, just to the edges, also brightened Phil's face up. So that was before and that's after. So before, after. So you can see here just for a slight tweak, it just brings Phil forward a bit whilst not losing his face behind, brings the eye into the middle of the the thumbnail, drag this over. I mean, when it's a small thumbnail, you're not really gonna notice that, but it's just like hitting a bit of light on Phil's face there. How it brings out, it makes his eyes pop a bit more. So this is my whole plan for Saturday. Um, Saturday, I'm gonna take the Canyon and try and calm. Uh, I couldn't find any tires. I haven't got some focus. I couldn't find any tyres, I couldn't find the ones I wanted, which were the uh, Schwalbe Pro Evo 28s tubeless. So what I what I did find were some £10 tyres on there. What I thought that you actually, I'll be filming it today, I guess, for you watching this. So tomorrow's Com Hunt episode, see, vlogging brain, I think. Sorry if I'm a bit grubby, I haven't had a shave or a shower yet. So hoping to get on the bike this afternoon, then I'll come back in and shave, but. As you can see, I don't think that will be happening. Oh, and I haven't got a bike. Now let's drop my bike down to Mark. So I've got, I probably need new chain, new cassette, new chain rings, new tire, definitely new tires. That's dangerous on that that bike. The other bike, I twisted the, the chain and it's like, it wasn't even one link. It was kind of like a few, it was, I don't know what I'd done to it. So that's down at Mark's getting a new chain. Let's drop that down. Yeah, so I've ordered these tires, which will come for the episode. So. I think the episode for Sunday um, would be uh, can I calm on £10 tyres or cheapest cheapest road tyres or I think of something. £10? I can't believe that. Fast rolling. Well, we'll see about that, shall we? In a way, it's one of those where I've come up with a thumbnail before and the title because it will be, yeah, you can just imagine the thumbnail, can't you? Like, lovely bike with £10 tyres on um, and does it make much difference? I wouldn't ride them in this weather, maybe, but we'll see. So they're the Lifeline ones, link below. So the so main episode will be, can I calm? on 10 pound tires. That might be a good one. Uh, Lee Baxter won the weight. So he guessed the correct weight, which was 104.2 kilograms. If I remember correctly, he guessed 104.4. Lord went back to get all the results so, and put them in. So thank you for that, Lord. So I see like Lord's comments on like uh, Ed, Phil's, everyone's. And it's just like, whenever whenever I see a cycling related video, I see, usually see a Lord de Lego timestamp. So um, thank you, Lord, for all the hard work you put in and all the hard work you put in on back pedal too. So thank you. Ed's new video coming out, came out yesterday. To me, it's coming out tomorrow. To you guys, it came out yesterday at, should we have a look? 4 p.m. on Friday. Say, stay safe, group riding. Oh, I know it's just bad timing. Mm, just thinking if it's strong enough wind to go and calm, but the, uh, <laughs> it's blowing trees over. Chi -chi. Good girl, you look pretty girl. You've had a trip, haven't you? Yeah, where is Alzi? Where is he? The camera's back. Oh, Gigi. oh, I don't like the camera. Lord will say you don't like the camera. I don't think you said hello to you, Lou. <laughs> Lou's uh, Chi Chi's mum. Hi! <laughs> <laughs> Always be rolling, cheer. So, your, your better half, Glyn. 
Uh, what are we talking about, Thrush? He's doing something crazy. He is. He is attempting to break the record going round Wales what? starting on Tuesday. Kiking. <laughs> <laughs> Walking, cycling. Yeah, I'm so used to it. Flying. Flying. Come on, Lenny. I'm not even on camera. Come on. I'm not even talking about it. <laughs> How many thousands of people have done it? Come on. Two thousand? What's the current record? Fifteen days. They only record it in days at the moment, apparently. So he's hoping to do fourteen or. So what, if he does fourteen and a half days, they'll round it up to fifteen, will they? Potentially, yeah. I don't know. Oh god. Yeah, we can put links below. He's doing the tracking stuff. Yeah, links to his blog, links to his tracker, kayakbritain.net. Maybe Ed would be able to go and wave him. And also, I just assumed that it was around the edge of Wales, but they can't, he's going to come all the way down the whole of Wales through the canal system. Roundabout, so you can pass around about the road. Like the road comes in from the side, you go all the way around the corner and then around to the traffic lights. Froggy. Did you know that? No. Yeah. So it's the seaside and the canal bit. Who's the official record holder at the moment, do you know? <laughs> no. <laughs> I should know. Do you I think know. Siri, would Siri know that? Hang on, hang on. <laughs> Who's the world record holder for kayaking around Wales? Is it a special sort of kayaking, just to say sea kayaking? Tyler, well, Tyler Brad's come up. Wales circumnavigation. I don't know, we might have to come back to you because I've... I've even typed it in right in Google. <laughs> <laughs> you two enjoying the wine? Oh, bloody Ed Latfrax over there. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I drank him earlier. To be continued. Yeah. <laughs> to be continued. Starts potentially Monday evening or Tuesday morning. Good luck, Glyn. Good luck. Can we have cheer? Yep. <laughs> She's got to go in the kiddie catcher. Bet not so bad, actually. <laughs> I don't know what that's. Hello. Politically correct. Maybe too much of an in joke. <laughs> Right, what have we got here then? Don't care about it, it's a Swift. This is backpedal, this is the best, it's brilliant. You saw Ed fell off his bike. The Ed's crashed, oh no. Yeah, I, I hope he's okay. I don't know, let's find out now. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>